Hello and welcome. Right, yeah, I thought let's stick these in first. We've done the bales. I've got the other one ready and we've got these to put in and also to set up doing the uh, seeds. Yeah, that was the main thing that we were going to do, which should really, that should bring an awful lot of income in, to be honest. So that's really fantastic. Ah, actually, oh, I've done it now. The Omatana, this one thing the Omatana is better at, in my opinion, in so much as the um, menu is better, it's just seeds. That's all you need, and it's one for one, so there's no loss. Um, production shared, yeah, if you look at the seeds from it, there's also an additional 100 um, manure. Not Oh, we've got plenty. We have got plenty, so I'm not going to worry, actually, yeah. Yeah, it's, there's way more than we need there. So do you know something? I'm not going to worry about that. Yeah, let's just do it. Do that on. Switch that on then, in the production shed, and not worry about that. But yeah, it would. It could be if we hadn't got 340 tons. Shouldn't we be sending that to the BGA? I would say that's probably a good idea. Yeah, this here, I've got them ready. But there's not really much room. Yeah, we need to wait a little bit. I think. We'll stick this in here. I'm going to concentrate on the big field because of work. Yeah, I'm not sure I've got enough time to do both, and I'd like to have a go at seeing if I can do the big one in time. Yeah, I know we've got the furthest to come with that as well. And the thing was the fluffy mods. It's it is only you, you and you. The, yeah, that's the the advantage and disadvantage of it. it is fast. It is good. But just can I go? Yeah, oh no, I'm hitting it. I might we'll just go past it. Yeah. Oh, that, that'll do. Yeah, so he is only you. It's not work friendly. It really isn't. Oh, that challenge yellow is nice, actually. It, it perfectly matches, so it just goes to show it does know what it's talking about with colours. That's the one we want. Fantastic. And let's take this to the edge of the field. We're going to get cracking. I'm going to go into a time lapse though because this is it is a bit of a monster. And so I don't think I'll do them both only because of the running back. Yeah, because that's the biggest one with them. I mean, although it's sort of in the middle of them both, it is also it's. A little bit of a pain. It's not. I'd normally stick it on the edge of a field because it is nicer. Uh, no, it's this way. It is. I recognise the bank. Oh, have we, have we lost the? Seriously? How on earth could you get jammed? Oh, you, oh, you were just being slow. ceases to amaze me sometimes how awful it can be. Right, let's drop this off. Uh, yeah, because we still need the tractor to grab it. Wow, oh, that's just stopped with that crack in it. So that is wonders will never cease. Right. It is time. I have unwrapped. I have even remembered to do the uh, pie. Right, I am going to say my words. We shall have a chat afterwards. So I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side.
I think we might actually do this. So, do you know something? Yeah, I'm going to come out of the time lapse a little early because, yeah, literally it is work for me and I, I didn't realise I'd finish in time. So, this is probably going to be a little bit of a short session, but it does achieve, I've always said that, whether it's an hour and a half beast or, 40, or 28 minutes and it's only a short session, it really is about focusing on the task that you've got to do. So, yeah, really as many a session I have to break down because it was an hour and a half and try to make it into a more palatable 45 minutes but yeah I do prefer it when you get a proper 45 minutes and that's how long the job takes but that's very rare it really is yeah you can see this does struggle on the bigger windrows as in you've got to give it a bit of time to suck it up it will do it but uh, yeah it is very similar to the snowblower just cannot for the life of me remember what the actual pro the other name was that everyone used to call it. But what it did it is was the snowblower but I can't think of its name. As in, yeah, this is not just me, it's me like literally it's just I can't remember at all. It's really strange. Imagine I did used to struggle with it. It's weird. There's certain um, human names as well that I struggle with. Um, Andrea is a name. I, I, obviously, I know it now. I'm saying it. But yeah, I can't remember Andrea's very well. I've struggled with that name a, a bit. It's just bringing it to mind. It's weird. I have no idea why that is a thing for me, but it is. Very strange. I think we should get all of this in this time. Yeah, I thought, well, I think we're going to do it. Yeah, this is amazing. To think that I'm, this is probably what I would be using on the Netherlands to get that awful lot of straw. That would have to think, I'd have to have one on. Uh, not on the edge of every field. No, I did, on the last episode where I said if, if you guys and girls would like me to do it. But I think it's fair. The other thing is, if you leave that, and you know, even a straw is still worth hundreds of thousands, but I mean, as silage, it's worth an absolute fortune. So, and look, the whole thing about the owning the farm is that you do your best to earn the very best from whatever you're doing. So you would, wouldn't you? You would just, oh, let's just sell it as straw when we can convert it to silage and sell it for energy and things like that. You would do it. And this is fantastic. I should leave it on the side and give the shop a ring. Yeah, that's a, a much, much quicker. Um, in fact, you know something, we're going to take it to the shop. We are going to be really good. Because it's, let's be honest, we are. One thing I've always loved about this particular Let's Play is we are right close to. Uh, yeah, the Sudbury Meadows, which I've said a few times, is my favourite map on FS19, and it, it, yeah, it's the one I cut my teeth on, really. It's uh, it, I classed it as home for a long time, and it is another let, another map that I actually, yeah, it didn't have any season support or precision farming. Whoever the model was that made it, I think they only made the one, and they weren't that bothered about. Um, right, let's just drop this off. Yeah, they, they just. I think it was for competition. There was some sort of competition that used to go on. No, you won't find it in there. You might find it there. Oh, I didn't realise we'd... Uh, but, uh, yes. Well, I didn't realise... Ah, we did, didn't we? Oh, do you know, I'm paying leasing costs all of the time. Yeah. There we go. So let's stick this last little bit in and see how well we did. Because I think we're doing quite well. We've certainly got a lot of uh, a lot from the big fields. An awful lot, really. But we've still got one and a half out of that. Hundred odd tons, I think, from that smaller field. I think that's right. But yeah, he's sometimes paying. more attention to what you're doing rather than counting right 
yes, run this across. I only indicated when there was a need. Like now, there is a need because there's a car to show. But when there wasn't, I didn't. But there was mostly cars to show, so yeah. Oh, I've double clicked. I'm, I'm a terror for that. I switch it off and on again. I don't know what it is. What? I've got the secret ability. Only I can stuff up clicking a button. <laughs> oh, do you know sometimes? Yeah, this actually has worked quite well because it's sort of yeah, it's a bit like a bit of an island and you've got to turn around anyway. So, I mean, of course, if it wasn't there, it would be easier. But as we know, we can't get rid of it, even if we... Yeah, it's part of the fixtures and fittings. Actually, let me just, yeah, let's just have a quick look to see. Right, 472 tons of straw. That is amazing. It really is. Now then, let us tell. Oh, no, it, it already is. It's silage. And it is, oh, no, it doesn't. Yeah, we're not top this yet. Right, to distribute. Right, that is where I'm going to leave it. Cracking session, truthfully. Yeah, we'll be pushing on towards all of our other, yeah, it's going to be, I think, probably a double because there's a lot going on in October. We've got olives, we've got nuts, pistachios, almonds, we've got uh, the corn harvest might naturally be in November, which is a good, yeah. So, yeah, but all that remains to be said because my alarm's going to go up in 30 seconds is thank you very much for watching. Truly do hope you're going to stick with me on this journey, and I'm going to say goodbye for now.